Good, good. Really, uh, I learned a, a whole lot. I was just telling the coaches, I think I probably learned learned so much in, in two hours or, or one hour than I did in probably four years, you know. Uh, I'm just trying to learn things. This is my second workout and everything. And so uh, it was it was really, really good for me. Uh, I think um, I, I just did my best and, and learned while, as, I, as I'm going. What was different between uh, this workout and the first workout you went through? Um... What was the difference? We did, I mean, we played We played in both, you know, with the drills in, in both, but at the same time in here, um, the coaches stopped to, to teach me, you know, uh, when I did something wrong or the way I did it in college, if it wasn't right, uh, they taught me how they did it in, in the league. And I think I learned I learned, I learned a, a great deal just, just uh, listening to them and, and repeating, you know, and so compared to where I, uh, I went to Miami yesterday where they did, they, they taught me after the workout, you know, after the workout they sat with me and, and taught me drills to, to help me improve and everything. And so I think it's, 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 it's great for me and I get, get to talk to the coaches and everything. So it's, it's a great experience for me. <laughs> Is shot blocking the, the skill you'd say you'd bring to the NBA in, in, in terms of the best part of your game? Uh, yes, I, I could say shot blocking would be, but at the same time, it's the energy. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm really an uh, energy guy. Uh, I love I love just getting everybody pumped up on the team, uh, running around and, and things like that, you know. And, and you got to love love playing, you know. And it's, it's something that I, I really think the energy that I bring, the block, sh uh, block shot and just playing defense and um, uh, the energy on, on dunks and, and layups. And I'm getting a lot better in offense and everything so I'm bringing a lot to it but at the same time you know it's, it's a learning process uh, you get one thing then you, you learn the next one you know is the shot blocking something you can show in these type of workouts or is, is that only seen in you know you know five on five or no 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 you uh, actually had a lot of blocks today and everything yes and uh, you can show it during the workout it actually shows you know uh, five on five situation yes you got you get a lot of options but when you three on three two on two and you still block a shot you know it shows that you really have the timing and and still know how to really do it do it well what uh, did you uh, interview with Miami after the workout uh, uh, no I actually interviewed with them uh, when I was in Portsmouth oh, okay yes what did they want to know just basic questions you know uh, who I am, what I do, uh, what type of person I am, uh, what do I, what I'm graduating with, and uh, what I, what are my goals in life, and things like that. You know, just just the basic things. Mm -hmm. Who do you remember who you talked to? Oh, that would be a very very hard <laughs> question. <laughs> okay. Was there anything they asked that you went? Hmm, what was that? Why did you ask me that? <laughs> <laughs> um, no. Not really, no. You know, um, I'm a communication major, yeah. <laughs> so I talk a lot and <laughs> I ask a lot of questions, so <laughs> I'm used to it. How did you get asked about the situation at, at Rutgers this past year and, and kind of how that took an effect on you? Um, Miami hasn't asked me that, no. Um, a lot of reporters asked me about it and everything, and uh, I mean... How, how can you deal with, with a situation like that? You know, you just keep playing for me. That's what I do. I, I just kept playing and trying to keep my team together. That was, that was my goal, you know, as a captain and, on, and on senior on the team. Whatever happened outside in uh, the media and everything, it was, it was what it is, you know. You can't do anything about it. And uh, all you could do is get out on the court and, and give it your best. And that's what I made sure all my teammates did when I, when I was out there and starting with me, you know, with the energy, like I said, I brought out all the energy and everybody followed with it. And that's, that's, that's what I like to be around, you know, uh, people that just feed off my energy and just keep going with it, you know. Uh, whatever happened at Rutgers, whatever the media was saying, whatever um, uh, the administration and everybody, the coaches and everything, that's their problem. We, I was here. We were there to play basketball and make a name for Rutgers, and we did what we, whatever, give the best what you, you can, whatever the result was, and that's that's what we did. Yeah. <laughs> did your coaches there say, hey, look, just you know, don't worry about every, don't worry about us. You just go play. Yeah. He he told told a couple times. You know, um, I had personal meetings with him mm -hmm. myself. Um, that's exactly what I told him myself. You know what? Not to worry about anything because we we here to play. 
no matter what everybody says, no matter uh, how people feel about him or anything, we, we're playing for, for Coach Hill until he's up there, mm -hmm. you know. And that's what exactly what we did. We just stepped up and, and played. Mm -hmm.